Hello friend, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe my channel if it is not subscribed. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Thank you for subscribing my channel. Friends, I am Emlal Sapota. I am PT tutor here at Best PT Center Chiton, Nepal. So far we have been discussing about different parts of PT, speaking, reading and writing. But today we are discussing one of the important tasks of PT listening, listening fill in the blanks. Listening fill in the blanks incorporates high marks for listening as well as writing. In order to achieve high marks in listening and writing, we need to correct fill in the blanks. So fill in the blanks, the marking goes for uh, listening as well as writing and listening uh, 6 marks and writing 7 marks. So in order to achieve high marks in writing, you need to correct fill in the blanks. So friend, without being delayed, we are going to discuss about what are the strategies, what are the tips, tricks and uh, strategies we are applying on the test day, we are discussing here. First of all, get ready and skim the general idea of what is the topic about. If you understand the topic, then you can easily guess the meaning that, that you listen in the text. Secondly, be ready to type the words that you listen on the text and don't care about the spelling, just write down on the notebooklet or in copy. Third, you write what you hear there. Please don't check the spelling at that time. If you check the spelling, you may lose another words for and just fill in the blank. Next, follow the speaker in the transcription so you do not missing the word there. Keep writing each missing words until the audio is stuck. Next, check and type. You need to check words, whether this word is sensible for the sentence or not. If you uh, feel it is not sensible for, for the words, then you should guess the another words. Now check the grammar, uh, grammar means you need to check the grammar and uh, grammar uh, noun, verb or adjective or adverb which word or which uh, part is uh, suitable for the sentence or for the blanks that should be checked properly in your uh, test. At last you need to check the spelling which is very important for it. If you do error or if you uh, make any mistake while writing the word or if you have any spelling mistake you may not get marks and you definitely uh, do not get marks in the test. So please check the spelling well. So it is very important for you checking the spelling, check the spelling and click the next. So friend, if you want to get very good marks, if you want to acquire very good marks in PT test, please um, upload my videos or please keep on watching my videos and which is extremely helpful to you to achieve high marks in your text. Thank you for watching it.